Okay, folks, welcome back to Ostrov. Looking at our new bridge here. Yep, she's quite the beauty. <laughs> the reflections in the water look great. The clip clop, clip clop. Yep, this is quite the game. Smoke coming out of the chimneys. Speaking of chimneys, we are building one massive kiln over here. Where's the entrance? Right down there. Aha. Got here a little late, a little while ago, while I was looking out around the rest of the map. This was just a big circle you can see inside. Anyway, a child has been born. We are in the middle of September. Honey should be rolling in, or beginning to. And apparently garlic is rolling in from somewhere. Hmm. Apples have no traders in town, though I wonder if any are... are pulling in from uh, from old uh, trades. Now it looks pretty dead out there. Dracachi would have been probably one of the last ones. Yeah. So... Well, nobody out there. Okay. So what today? <clears throat> Pottery. Yeah, we're, we're, we already saw that. Wow. They move quick. They do. Close your eyes and they've got some timbers up. After this, we're going to go to the brewery. And I switched to a different hops farm. I'm thinking if we're going to do hops, we'll come off of this end first. Let these guys, hopefully let these guys run it. Hopefully somebody in this run right here will not already be hired and we will willing to work over there. Um, leaving more of this available should this become farm fields for the farm over here. Now we could go off this way with farms. We could... It could give us a reason to come out over here. Yeah. Give us another reason to put one more bridge in, too. Cool. <laughs> um, after that, we're getting into the distillery, which needs that farm for grain and barley, or wheat and barley. Then another row house to go through and try to man all of those, as well as all of these houses over here that are slowly but surely getting their trees taken down. Where are you? There there and there yep then back to these guys so I have a feeling that they're finally going to get these taken down one by one or actually we missed a couple trees over here otherwise that would have been done uh-huh now little by little don't truly need them right now so it'll happen when it happens Otherwise, charcoal in the system right now is 35,000, so we're doing fine there. Where did this ever go? Uh, probably that one. Let's drop you in next just to get that done, get that taken out, make it just a little bit easier to get water. I stuck it over there to make sure there was no way that it was in the way of the bridge, whenever that, wherever that went in. At the time, I wasn't sure. Anyway, I still like this nice little area. Need to create more of those. Um, gonna have our grass growing back into here, hopefully. Actually, I don't know that for sure because they keep clipping this, and it wherever they step, it clears a little bit beyond them to make the path look a little wider. So, hmm. Anyway, give that some time. Our fruit trees. Let's see. This is September. These should have been real. So next year we'll have to check to see if any of these folks have brought any fruit in. Um, I need to create this kind of a thing over here. Kind of waiting for this last building to go in. Then we're going to decide whether we're going to have any of these arches on this side or not. We don't have room to put an arch in here. The, the, it just won't let us. The bridge is too long. So... We're not going to be able to duplicate this no matter what. So do we even try? We could do this kind of a shape over here and bring it in and over. But to what advantage, I don't know. Don't know if I'm going to put anything along this shore like we did over there. So, eh, just not sure. I mean, we could stick some more fishing in there. Could do it. We can boat yard out of there still. And bring boats all the way to here and put another fishing dock. What's that look like? Just out of curiosity. What's a building like that? How well does it fit? It does. It will accept it. 
As long as that br that wall isn't in the right place. Um, actually, it kind of looks like it fits right here, like it belongs there. Hmm. Gonna have the farm over here. You know, I actually kind of like that. Let's just stick it there. And whether we build it or not is another thing, but it'll remind me later that... Wow. Great big milk bottle. Now this was more like a milk bottle. What is this one? It's more like a... Hmm. Moonshine jug. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, what else is happening? I guess we can kick the speed up and let something happen to us like that. But luckily, uh... <clears throat> Let's see, you want to sell to us. Now, where are we on stone now? Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Deal, we'll take it. All right, so you want from us flour. Um, 28 days left. Flour, let's do, we have quite a bit of wheat. Though I do want to start buying some, now that we're feeding the pigs with some of it. So, in fact, we need to go check up on the pigs. But we're getting into October. I should get a lot of, of garden goods that the pigs can eat. Let's do 800 right now. Deal and get me over to our trader to put 800 flour in there. What was that last one? Pottery's done. There. Anything else for... Blocklia. Um Potatoes are I know. We're going to use every bit of that now. Dried fish. Whoa, doing pretty good in dried fish now. Let's sell you a thousand of it. Deal. Dried fish. Temporary. Sallow. We have 54. We had bought 400. And now that that's gone, we'll wait and see if we start balancing out or if we still need to be purchasing it a little here a little there clothing doing pretty good textiles got a bunch in storage leather metal parts horse tack honey honey 1500 1400 I think we'll call that a done deal there um, you just popped up slower down we just hit October which means you just rehired so we're waiting for folks to show up over here and go to work. Okay, we've got a pottery now. The pottery uses not enough clay. Um, what have we got here? For batch 100, we need 200 clay and 50 glaze. Firewood or coal. Batches of 100. Take 60 units of charcoal. Okay. So no water, no anything else. Just those two and, and coal. Okay. So you, everyone's available and everyone's available. And I could see that also being a March, August, September thing. And we'll bring in two people to start with and see how that goes. You need... Let's see here. Firewood of zero. Charcoal of 1,000. We've got 5,000 capacity in here. Glaze of 500. Clay of 1,000. Mm, it said 200 to 50, right? 250. So, 4 to 1. Alright. So, let's make that 2,000 clay. 250, 500 glaze. And no firewood, so that gives us 3,500, 1,500 left in storage for pottery. Which should never build up that high, so that should work fine. Alright, not enough clay to start production. Clay is still... Is not. Now, we moved it all out of here. We do have it over here, though. That's right, yeah. We took out the clay and the sand over here. So, we got clay there. And we've got clay here, which means carts are going to be rolling through and wishing they could cut right through this. Still comes down to wondering if we should put a thoroughfare through. Though I wouldn't do that until everything is built to know exactly where this fence is going to go. 
But I suppose, just out of curiosity, we could do that and put it back in, leaving a gap in between. Um, go from there. No, grab you. That work? Yeah. Go from there. Now, come on, snap. There you are. Two. I can't see both at the same time here. So we'll just make some guesses there to there to there. And how bad did I mess that up? Actually, not too bad. Okay. Yeah, close enough. That's not permanent, but we'll we'll give that a try. See if I like it with the road out there or not. Um, just kind of staring at this. We have winter coming. And I'm just noticing that all the gardens are emptying out. Um, we're going to build the brewery, then we're going to build hops, and that's kind of backwards. You should have the hops growing and then build the brewery, but it's all going to happen during the winter anyway, so it's no real biggie. But then we're going to hit the distillery, and then we're going to need grain, and there's a chance by all of this time we may or may not have the farm done by planting season. So maybe we should move the farm up and get that at least uh, into the plan before we get to next March. So let's do that. The rest can go back to that that other order. All right, talk myself out of that too. We get the two planting things done first, just to make sure that they're all planned out, manned, and ready to go by the time uh, March first comes or whenever. I assume hops starts then but i was surprised that they were able to plant all these trees in the dead of winter so maybe hops has an exception like that as well so let's get those all going um what else we're on october just kind of on cruise control right now the town is doing its own thing and and just seeing all the boats are in and all the boats are in it's not like it's winter time just happened to have all six boats in at the same time, which is kind of odd. So there they go. They all took a break at the same time, and they're all getting back, jumping in their boats, and making our little river look uh, look busy again. How are these guys doing? Over here, they're all coming in, ready to take their breaks. Yep, off they go. Kind of fun to watch. Jump in, drop off the fish. Out the door they go, and off to take a rest. Yeah, so we've got people resting out over here. I've yet to see anyone hit these last two benches. Just wondering about taking a rest in here. There's a lot of activity. Look at that. Looks like the gardens are pretty much in over here. So let's see what, uh, wow, kind of activity we had. So lots going in. Even more there. Perfect. That's what I like to see. Even with all this, just barely touching the capacity. But now that it's available, is anybody coming back to stock these guys? They are. So we've got beetroots and has the flu. And carrots on their way in. Potatoes are on their way in. Everything seems to be happy here. The, the slaughter dude should be quite busy from here on out. He should. I saw a hundred hide just move over and boom, another batch is, is in. I think it's this guy. Should see that starting to move, right? Uh, tanning until April. And this one just began, so need another 300 hides and starting to collect all of the goods. 120 lime is on its way in. Lime is still stored over here, right? Yeah, and there's 2,400 of it over there. Okay. Uh, sheep, how you doing? You're over here. No batches are running. There's 150 waiting, so one more sheep. Um, do we know who you're going after next? You are taking a rest. We don't. Okay. Sheep. 31 out of 30. So somebody is soon. So may as well go ahead and do a three-year-old ram. Plenty of other rams in there. And how's the milk coming in? Okay. We've got cheese and butter. And I don't know if I've ever seen Smetana in here. We've ever hit enough of a limit here to move into the third one. But milk is, is moving in and out. Another hundred is on its way, and we're not... Okay, that was interesting. 
it arrived and it was already old when it arrived. That's why the uh, the rot bar moved down so quickly. And then it just got used. So we're using it as fast as we can make it, it looks like. Okay. I'm just watching all the activity. I'm running at a faster speed, so it's happening a lot faster than I would normally see all this movement. Anyway, slow her down. We have Marifa. Let's see what you guys want. World map right there. Still have stone on its way in from Balaklia. Marifa. Nothing. Well, wheat. Let's go ahead and start bringing more wheat in. I think so. Can I handle this quantity, though? We have a bunch of stone that's coming in. It's going to really fill up our trading post along with another 4,000 of this. We're at 17.3. Let's do it. All right, we'll bring that in. I uh, don't need to buy anything else to sell. Dried fish, 1,400. Let's leave 1,000 in town storage. So let's sell 500. Not 5,000. There we go. Deal. And let's bring some dried fish into here. 500. Temporary you. Undo the temporary on the salt to make you 2,000 again. Good. And dried fish. Sunflower oil, where are we at? 1,000. So we'll keep that. Buckwheat, just out of curiosity, we're up to 5,000 again. Flour, we're still at 1,500. And flour is in what condition these days? I haven't looked for a while. You're new, and there's only 60 of you. So the rest is back over here still. And we're three quarters remaining on the lifespan of that. Let's go ahead and sell off some of that. So child has been born up there. Flour, let's get rid of 500. Just to keep things moving through the system. Keep it fresh. Uh, flour right down over there. And 500. What else? Anything else? Sallow. We're at zero again. Okay. So we are not making it as fast as we're using it. Chicken eggs, horseshoes, salt. You guys do buy our salt. We've got quite a bit in stock. Though we've got to bring it all over here. Okay, it's Marifa. It's a good sized trip, distance wise. Let's see if we can pull off 2454. Deal. 2455. And temporary you. Okay. Well, that's not temporary. That's not too far beyond 2000. We'll let it build up to that. Now we've got to get this in. Where is that actually stored these days? It's not here, right? Well, it should be, but it's not. Some salt was over here. There it is. Let's get... Let's get 2,500. Well, was that 28? Let's move all of it to here by cart. Okay. Um, what was that? We... What is that? No workers to thresh harvest. We had a little bit left over. Interesting. We didn't get the job done this time. We took a lot longer to get it in because this is... Well, no, the harvest hasn't changed. It's only sowing... Yeah, it's only sowing that has changed. Hmm. Okay. Um, so we... No longer have one person on for off-seasons. We could fix that. One person working these other months to take care of the animals, too. Yeah, let's do that. In fact, that's how I used to do it. I don't know when that got changed. So let's... I guess it's the same for all of them. So let's just apply to all. Okay. So yeah, one person should be there just to make sure we have water for the for the oxen. All right, you are full. And yeah, you're making it faster than... Can I run just one guy? I wonder if I can. Because we just make the ore faster than we can do anything with it. Let's take you down and see if it freaks out and if not we'll take you down as well we don't need the ore in that fast got quite a bit over here still if anything we need labor is to bring more of that over um, we're running seven months a year over here no what is that five six seven eight months a year we could add march but i want these guys to help out with the harvest so i 
that's even making more. In fact, I never even thought about selling iron. Um, who is it that buys that? Right here. We got 3,100 in town. Let's get rid of 2,000 iron. Let's do that deal. And right there, iron. Where are you? Right there, 2,000. First iron sale. Bring that in. And it is being stored where? At one point I stuck some in here. There it is. So let's just do that. Let's, get a, let's move a wagon in here. Let's move all of you to there. And I'm curious to see how quickly that command happens. Anybody just take off? That is here. And you're already out there. And that is here. And nobody has just taken off. Was there one over here? He must be loading up. I'm curious to see what happens to you. Uh, what was that? Farm completed. Okay. So he's going to move in and park. Oh, he's going to go through the front door and go in and park. Park in the garage. Yep. Then what does he do? Does he immediately take off? Nope. He goes, to, he goes home. Takes a break. Okay. So do we have another worker already here waiting? We don't. Actually, you... There you are. You're taking a rest. Okay. So waiting for... Not you. Supplying resources and going to work. Waiting for you to come to work. Unless, of course, this happens first. Nope. Doesn't look like it. So you and you. Speed it up. Let's see what happens. Because I assume that one is going to... Yeah. He's going to go home and... He took his, got his paycheck and... Off he goes. So this guy is on his way in. He should grab one of those two wagons. And, well, somebody did. Okay. You are on your way to right there to eat the iron. Cool. It works. Otherwise, you are coming in to get... You've got stone. Ah, we should have quite a few wagons rolling in to drop off stone. So we need to get stone out of here. How much is in here already? 6,000. Let's get... Oops. Let's wagon all of the... Can I? How much room do I have? I got lots of room. Okay. Let's wagon stone to here. Perfect. And that should relieve any problems we have with storage in here. Right? That's leaving, that's leaving, that's leaving, and that's coming and going. Okay, we're good. A pig has died of thirst again? Do I really need to hire all this up just to get these guys to bring water? It's kind of looking that way. We have 25 pigs. So, I guess I need to bring a second guy into here just to keep up with the, with the pigs. It kind of looks that way. Okay. We're going to hire this up even further. They take too many rests compared to what they need to get done. We've got 75. Yeah, so I'm assuming that it got down to zero. And before the 100 came in, one just couldn't wait any longer. Must be what it was. All right, well, I guess that's as good as we're going to get it now. How are we doing out in this area? Four ladies are making textile. Three ladies are making clothes and warm clothes. Three more doing the same. Two ladies are making shoes. Yeah. You are doing that over here. We got one guy on converting sunflowers to oil. And we have shut down the saddlery. Because we just don't need that much horse tack. Do you have you still in here keeping up with hemp and flax so there was hemp has it all moved already if it's already been moved okay you yep it's already been moved okay uh you need another guy but you've got 10 logs so you just keep working on those logs okay otherwise how are we doing over here we hired two ladies and she's already making earthenware okay Cool. 
So let's slow it down and think about what that means. Earthenware. Um, that's right, there was one more right there. Store. And I left a space. Oh, we have a hop yard done. Good. We've got glassware in there, and now we're going to have earthenware. Right there. Perfect. So over here, did we have one more space there? Where was... It seems like there was an empty somewhere. Now I'm going to have to evict something. Okay. I'll think about that one. There is definitely an empty space over here. Uh, in fact, you don't even need to be hired, to tell you the truth. So was there still a space in one of these two, like this one? No. Right there. You can be earthenware. Uh, right there. And you don't need to be hired either. Okay, so we'll work with that. And get to the hops here in a moment, but let's... I didn't miss anything, right? That one, that one, that one. Yeah, this one. So here it was this one. Had an empty space. So right there. All right. So now we've got that all up for sale. Um, hops. So you are here. I don't know when you actually grow or waiting for a new season. Okay. But if I hire somebody, will they pre-plant? Or is this definitely a... A spring to fall thing. Let's see. I will hire. At this point, I guess I'll hire anyone. Because I don't know who's available in here. The lady took it. Going to work. So let's check in on these guys one more time. Lots available, lots of water. And I'd really like to get that thousand water in that I've been asking for all this time so this never happens again. You know, we've got laborers available, and it's it's everyone. Interesting that they won't just keep bringing things over. I mean, we've got supplies and supplies, taking a rest, taking a rest. But all these other ones are still calling for more, up to 200 on these. 400 on this and 1,000 on that. So, you know, the jobs are available. I guess it just depends on who lives close enough and is interested in working. Yeah, still don't know what to do with this area. I don't have a certain answer for that. It's something that would probably best is a town service. And you can see the, uh, the, the, the traffic patterns here. Nobody has a reason to go this way, apparently. Well, there's, oh, I see, just enough to get up to the gazebo. Yeah, gazebo... I was thinking about that over here. Let's go check out the, the hops farm again. But this probably needs to be in here along with a number of other things. But gazebos just kind of work with uh, with markets. They just do. All right, so line you up like so. Right in the center. I think the well's going to be fine over there at that end. So right in the center. That gives us a starting point. Once that builds, I'll start building, you know, plantings around it. Need to get plantings around a lot of these houses still and make this look a little bit better. Hops, she is going to work. Just getting here after all that time. Speed you up. And you are doing what? You are working. <laughs> yeah, I don't get the sense. You're not moving around. I would imagine plant number one is here, but I might be wrong. Doesn't look like there's any activity. Okay. So let's set you up to run. Um, we'll start you in February this time. So we know the difference. Yeah. So you can come back or somebody can come back in February. And then we'll just have to make note of when things actually change. And see, uh, see what month that starts to plant. Is it the same as all of these? makes sense that it is but these all of the gardens aren't they're april i think they're april whereas this is march so how that fits into there i'm not sure and then these don't really do anything until july now that they're planted and that is so strange that these no longer get taken down after so many years 19 years 19. 
Now, I'm pretty sure in my Alpha 1 series that after so many years they would go through and start cutting them down and then replanting. And that's why they take, uh, they take firewood. Or you can click remove trees if you want to change it all out. But I was almost certain I remember random trees missing. It would be a random time, just like the random age of when the ox die. And they take a tree down, or two or three trees down, to signify they've kind of run the, the end of their course. And then the next you know season, you see a new little sapling in that place. That's what I remember of the orchards from, you know, from the whenever the orchards were introduced. If that was Alpha 1, or if that was just me playing a little on my own afterward. But I seem to remember that. Kind of a, you know pieces of tree missing here and there in the bigger orchards as they were, were replaced as they were needed. So that's what I remember. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that isn't a thing or maybe I'm thinking of a different game, but uh, it's been so many years since I remember that. So the details are a little, uh, little misty. Anyway, you are the brewery. Big brick building. Nice. <laughs> Wagons wa rolling right through it. Uh huh. So our smokestacks over here. At least it's the opposite end of the school. Yeah, I kind of forgot about that. Didn't want to put all this next to the school. It just didn't look right. But so you're this guy over here. From here, it almost looks like a square stack. But yeah, it makes sense. It would be round. Okay. Well, let that build. Speed it up. So how are the fulling mills going? Not enough wool. We have run out. Okay. Well, now we know. You guys don't need to be running the whole time. So let's take you down. I'm going to take you down as far as October goes. Uh, let's just do that to everyone. So not that one. There, apply to all. Okay. So these guys have been running too long. What else needs minor tweaks and adjustments here and there? You still don't have more people, but you still have eight logs to go. So you're one month off and... Okay, so we're in December. Let's do that. Take you off there. Do that. There? I don't know. Two on, one off is kind of what I'm playing with, but I don't want you hired in March. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. We got two guys in there now, three. Let them take down a bunch of trees through here, and then they're gonna start taking this trail out through here. Yeah, little by little it's gonna gonna look good, but right now everything's gonna start turning white. Which makes it so hard to to see. To distinguish buildings. Yeah. But you guys are going to get built. And I'm going to sit here and just watch this for a little bit. Riffa's back. And they're still rolling through. Yeah. <laughs> now, that's going to change the wagon pattern. I guess we're going to concentrate more on our main road here. Which is the reason to put this in right where it was. I wanted to really solidify this road out here. But they are putting all of the rafters in. Are we over here now? Yeah. Putting all the, what would you call those? The cross ties or the, uh, all those furring strips? No, there's a, there's a name for these guys that the, that the uh, shingles would attach to. Of course, nowadays, we just fill this whole thing with plywood. You can attach the shingles anywhere you want, but stringers? Stringers kind of sounds right. Yeah. Long time ago, I wanted to put up a, uh, a timber frame house. Kind of like the one that I built in the Aloft series that I recorded. Built a big timber frame house over there. And all of these different uh, structural pieces are part of that system. Alright, we have a brewery. And what are you? Interesting. This guy, the wind takes it and spins it around so that the, uh, the wind current's always blowing it away rather than blowing down in and through that is cool i like that that yeah that looks like there's a center point there and it pivots that is well thought out interesting two stacks 
One inside. Huh. White. No, that's... That's not a burner. That's storage, isn't it? This must be the main... Uh, huh. Trying to... Wish I'd paid more attention before the roof went on. I just assumed that that, that was, but you wouldn't have a wooden door on it if it was. So that's something different. Anyway, what are you? Brewery. We are needing... Let's think about this. Put it on slow. Beer production, several steps. First, the hops are dried. Barley is germinated, dried, or malted. The resulting hops and malt are boiled in water in a process called mashing. Resulting mash is fermented for one month. I'm guessing the fermenting happens in that other chamber with the, the airflow. Uh, beer is produced in batches. Choose the amount of beer you want. Uh, in one batch, a number of batches. To start the batch, your workers will gather barley, hops, and drinking water. So not a platform, not a dock. In equal proportions for mash stage, there will be... Uh, they will gather the type of fuel you specify. Okay. All right, so lots of stuff. Wrong one. <clears throat> Not going to hire anybody at this point, unless maybe just to fill things up. Um, let's go with charcoal. And I guess we'll check all the boxes for now just to, just to see it happen. But nothing's going to happen until we designate batches, batch size, and employ it. Okay. Which means we're waiting for this to happen. So we're December. What else to do this winter? You're mothballed. You're mothballed. Um, you guys are taking down trees over here. Do we have a team out and about? Going to work, going to work, sawing logs for wood. Kind of stalling, waiting for these guys to go to work. Alright, you're sawing logs too. You're going to work. And are you waiting to take a tree down? Chopping a tree. There they go. Okay. Four logs are in. We're going to give them two months of work. You guys are still working on here. Good. So they'll probably finish this. And I could designate the rest of these trees here they somehow got missed but now they're the last so they're not going to get done until all of these get done so that's kind of a shame but we could take out that edge there that edge there and do we take this out we should at least take that out and do we cut through here I think we do so let's take out whatever is in there Okay, so these guys are going to have work for a long time. Now, how about these guys? And, yeah, we're still too full over there. Um, you. Red X's are all done. No logs, no nothing. Okay, you guys are finished. Until I have work for you to do, we clean you out. Right? There are no logs in the last of the firewood and everything's being hauled away. Alright, so that puts five guys back into the system. Okay. Um, you guys can start filling firewood. What does that mean? Here, 8,000 is being re restocked. 10,000 and, and 5,000. Okay. Well, the carts and the wagons are doing their job. They are doing the regular deliveries. I can turn you back off again. And next is the distillery. Right in there. Probably won't run either of these two till next time. Got to get uh, supplies in stock. In fact, let's uh, slow that down a little bit and just kind of watch this. This one, where would it be? Right in here. Distillery looks like what? Somewhere in a corner we have one stack. Okay. So by the shape of it, I'm guessing it has to do with this structure right here. Otherwise, wells. We need water for these guys. Wells build quickly, so it wasn't a, 
wasn't a rush to get them in. Exactly where you do not use water. But there's a nice space right here for a well. I think that makes sense. Yeah. Now, we are using this a little bit as a path. No, we're not. So we could go right up against the building, or we can just be right here in the middle. But it is nice to be able to see carts roll through without something in their way. So I think right there for a while. Ah, wrong one. There. And we haven't seen a more of a, just a pump well in a long time. Does that work here? Or is that too long? Actually, it works really good. Yeah, right there. So you get brought in and move you to there. And <clears throat> that's one well there. We have another well at this point here. You're there. Where else kind of works? I know we're going to need another one in here. And we could do that same idea. Yeah, we could. So let's put you in. Though, I guess that's just scaffolding. Okay. Let's, let's kick you in far enough that they have to drive around you. I see there's a fence around the base, too. Yeah. Let's do that. And halfway down the front of the building. Right there. So you go in as well. And what are you? The gazebo. You go in, too. Let's get you done. And you are a fishing dock, which I don't know if we're going to build. Okay. Back over here, row house. A warehouse. Right here, just to fill in that void. Sure, that's a quick, easy thing. Put you in with a gazebo. Small granary. That was just for show. Sure. Where are you? Right there. Let's move you into that area, too. So we get a bunch of these sort of things built real quick. Speed you back up. And think more about wells. So that's one well per these two buildings so far. Then something that's probably a little more uh, commonly accessible. We have over here. Though if we do, these the chickens are just going to do that instead of come down to this one anymore. So that probably doesn't work. We have a space in the trees, but we're not we're only accessible from here to get up into there. Kind of, yeah. This little path there, little path here. And we can kind of get into there. We already have that one. Um, a well by the school doesn't work. There's no space left. Except for behind the school. Now, pick rectangle. But... Okay, we do have access kind of to here. That's access there. Um... Road. Road. That is an, ac an actual road there. Okay. So if we were to turn it this way, we could probably get away with that. Okay. You're there. And let's think about one more of those somewhere. So that gets us one, two near this. And one and one more near this. This space is too wide. This wasn't meant to be a road. So it would be nice to fill something else into this area. We do have a cart parking there. Do have a well already right there. Huh. Otherwise, another well somewhere nearby that could be used, but it could also be for housing sure let's do that right there or do we do it here no trees to come down let's do that you are also in that mess of all those little things all right so that will take care of all of those Balaklia is here Balaklia we these to buy stone we get from Balaklia let's go ahead and buy that other group and that should set us up in stone for a while. Don't think we'll need to buy any more after that. You want from us flour, 
we're doing well. Okay, so let's head into here. How much time left for Balaklia? 22 days. Ah, uh, flower, let's bring... Let's bring 1,200. Deal. Flower. And what? Potatoes are a no. We're down to five something. Dried fish. Um, we're going to be making new here real soon. Let's do 1,000. So I guess we're back in the, uh, the fish business. Dried fish. Well done. We're going to be spammed with that for a while. Um, slowing it down. We've got a lot of helpers jumping in. Uh, Sallow. I did not buy any. And we're back to 382. Meaning we have four markets. They cleaned us out, but they're still satisfied. So we were allowed to build up a little bit more in storage. I like that explanation. Okay, leave that alone. Clothing, we're, we could do 500, not 5,000. Deal. Clothes, right there. And what do I have? One left? One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. So, textile, leather, leather. It's time to start buying some more. We'll never make enough leather for ourselves. The rate we're making all these clothes to sell. Um, or stack and honey. Honey, where are we at? We're at less than 2,000. We're going to use a big chunk of that throughout this year. Let's leave that alone for now. Until that uh, balances itself out. I think we're done there. Okay, you're finished. I need a place to click where I don't open a new box. And I am in that 50 minute range. So what do we need to kind of clean up? Go faster and see if we can get to at least February, if not March, and see if we can see this thing fire off. Did the farm get put in? It did. Okay, slow her back down and think about this for a while. And unfortunately, it's all white out. Yeah. Farm, add field. Let's go for four fields and we can work our way partially up the hillside here so an entrance just debating this I shoot across I got circles all the way out here so if I went this way it's all the way up there if I went this way it's narrow huh let's Oh, we were talking about cows here at one time. Okay, so maybe we do go up here. So what if we did something like this? I can get out to here. And I don't want to go too far up. Something along those lines. Where is that? That's pretty close. Over there kind of feels weird up against the mines. We'll see. I do kind of like that, though. Just if the next one wraps around and drops in. Okay. Let's do that. Let's delete this guy. And let's do think about hops starting from this side. Maybe it's these three. Maybe farms are out here. Maybe. I also like the idea of getting farms in here, too. Um, build a copy. Snap to here. Okay, bridge. What does that mean, bridge? This is the bridge that goes through to whatever is going to happen up here. Does this need to, or does that just get us to the farm fields? Which means leave a little space above. Doesn't have to end at the bridge. Yeah. So you're something like that. Something like the top of the hillside. 
Place is occupied. I don't know what that means. Oh, we were conflicting right here. Because it pops outward. So I've got to go more like this. Even that doesn't work. I gotta go a lot higher. I guess I gotta go a lot higher. Yeah, that now it doesn't conflict. Okay. And keeping it below the crown of the hill is about there. And we're too long. So about there. Too long. There. Too long. There. Alright. So that's that one. Hmm. There's one really weird looking field to try and make this work. I heard a noise a while ago. What was that? Stone well. Demolition complete and more wells. Okay. We are into February. You have... You will be hiring. Okay. What was that? I'll right click to cancel. Alright. Let's speed you up again. That is there. Kind of want this to go more of an angle like this. So this can and this can more angle toward the bridge. If we can only get that far anyway, we may as well make it look intentional. Yeah. So this may or may not be functioning this year. We'll see. I feel like it's if I do, it's going to be next episode anyway. Probably is. Died of old age. Yeah. Let's take a look at our graveyard again. We're getting there. We have another row up here available, but beyond that, we're we just well one two three four. Is there anything right here? No. So four, and then that back row. Ah, uh, two back rows. Okay, there's there's more than I thought. So yeah, we've got we've got a few more years over there. Bunch of exclamation points. Yeah, I think I'm going to set these fields and then set their rotations after the episode is over. But you get a sense of what we're looking at here. Do I do more over here? I think I'll do two over here and two over here. And twist them a little bit so they do align properly with the, the two, two different roads. I think it'd look better. And then I think we'll do cows over here. And... Yeah, something like that. So, it's all coming together. Anything else to check out before next episode? Pigs have finally got a thousand water. Okay, so that was my answer from a couple episodes ago. We need a lot more people in here to bring the supplies over. I never had that problem before. I was working fine with only one person running the chickens. Never had a problem. But I think more... I've heard more milk comes from having more workers in the cow sheds. And someone was saying somewhere that that's the same way with the chickens. More people are in, the more eggs you get. So for that matter, and I think our population can handle it now, let's do that and move that across. Apply to all. Three and ones. Yeah. Gazebo's done. Let's go take a peek at that. See what that looks like, although it is in the snow. So can't see as much, but it is nice that we can see all of the the uh, products. And look how many we've got. I mean, there's a lot of stuff for sale now. We're filling these out nicely. Okay, child has been born. Balaclia is back. Don't think there's anything we need to do with Balaclia. Um, what is next in our list? We're working on this warehouse. That's going to go in real quick. The other wells are in, so we'll see those real quick. If I can find them, there's this guy over here. There's another one out over here. There's the stone well to put in right there. And another one out in this area, right there. Great. So all the wells are in. And I think I, I can leave them housing and production. Production is going to use them anyway. But a person could be walking through and grab a bucket of water if they want to. I don't think there's a problem there. How many logs did you guys get out of your two months? You didn't do enough. Okay, so let's set you a little more aggressively then. We'll just go for it. Yep, 
our normal pattern and we get these trees taken down for the longest time we were stuck at 18 logs and I guess we're transporting it out of here now we're transporting it out into here about as fast as we can make it down to 600 down to 2200 so we had a rash of charcoal being made over here down to 1000 so what have we done with charcoal there's 32,000 so we're maintaining it's working folks it is so let's call this one done and I'll catch you next time thanks for watching bye bye